Hey guys, Anthony Kai here, and today we are looking at uh, a new build, I guess, that I could say that I have done. So the idea of this build might end up being quite controversial. Uh, not my intent, of course. However, this right here is our LGBT rec center that also houses one of our new townies in our Sims world. Um, that's not the controversial part. The controversial part is that it is also a, uh, a, a church. So, um, if you guys have an issue with that, it's not my intent to, like, offend anyone ever. Uh, but, yo, y'all know how it is. Like, Sims World is be simming, right? Like, it's just a Sims World. Uh, and actually, I got the idea from none other than, of course, uh, Shameless. So, here we are. Here's our LGBT center that was once... A oh, fucking A. Okay. Hang on. One more time. Ba -doo -ba -doo -ba -doo. I was just hoping to be able to see that I was too tall for this here thing. Okay. This should be good. All right. We're also going to go ahead and hit play because we all know I like watching them move around and stuff out back. So we're actually going to go into this door here. Um, I did base this church on a church in my actual home uh, town. I did not do that wall properly. Oops. Anyway, that looks fine. All the same. But the outside of the church and the layout of the church is very similar to one that I have grown up in. Uh, so here is our kids room. Uh, there isn't a lot of stuff in here, because I wasn't quite sure what to put in here, to be honest. Uh, obviously, here's our dining room. That's where the, this, the whole thing opens up into. I mean, we've got the two entry rooms, but we got the dining room as well. Uh, with a little jukeboxy looking thing. We got some cool little, uh, <laughs> curtains there. Uh, and I'm not actually sure why the curtains are there. I do believe on, like, holidays and stuff, they open those up because of how many people show up. But I'm not 100% sure if that is the actual reason. Anyway, here's a little community kitchen. It's not actually a community kitchen. It's just, uh, God, what is his name? I think his name is Trevor. So this is just Trevor's kitchen. However, it's supposed to look like a little community kitchen because, you know, he's running the, the LGBT rec center. So there's that. Um, I am going to save the coolest room, in my opinion, for last. Um, so we're going to come in here. We're going to show you guys this little office where actually uh, Fletcher himself... Or not Fletcher. God, that's his uh, actor's last name and because the, the character didn't have a last name. I had to, you know, I use that one. Please don't hate me for that. However, uh, this is Trevor's office area. Oh my god, I forget how much space... Sure, you can like video games, bro. I do not care. Uh, but well, as we go through walls and everything else... Oh, bye, dude. Um, but he's got a little library office type dealio there. And um, obviously, you know, a little jukebox, which I've already pointed out because it's so cool. And then, of course, you know, we got the... And I'm not too sure how people will feel about this one either, just because, you know, I've turned it into an LGBT center. But why didn't I remove the uh, gendered bathrooms? You know, I don't know. So our, the one in my church actually has a drinking fountain here, but obviously we can't do that in The Sims, so that's what that is. That is just a thing. Uh, this is a bathroom. <laughs> a little community bathroom. I think this one's the men's room. Uh, yeah, it's blue. But, yeah, these are all just the exact same toilet, exact same thing. Uh, but it, it is a cutie. Oh, yeah, it's definitely the men's room. It's blue. All right, uh, and that's, that's gonna get me yelled at too but oh well it's fine everything's fine there's the women's room which is another thing that i'm probably you know whatever which is of course pink so you know i say of course god i feel like y'all are gonna hate me but same toilets you know same same kind of basic dealio i wonder where he went i wonder if he went in oh who's that that's not him is that Lip? That might be Lip. I, hey, look, Ian's here, too. That's exciting. Why are y'all here? It's fine. So here is our little... Uh, this is the living room, family room type dealio. 
which I think is so cute. Like, look at this. It's so cute. You got your little TV. You got your little... Yeah, it's just cute. Also, this is where um the body of Christ in our church would have been kept, so that's why there's a little altar thing there. Anyway. Oof, this is nice, right? Wow. That's what you choose that for. Okay. Whatever, bro. It's not a biggie, so now we're gonna come in here. Now here... I didn't change the ceiling. Whoopsies. Anyway, we choose to ignore that and the fact that some of those are apparently in a ceiling. <laughs> but here is where, you know, commuting and stuff would have been given. I don't know why he's in. That is, that that's Trevor, right? Yeah, that's Trevor. So he's just chilling. This is going to be the, the bedroom type deal, but it because it's a church, you know, the bedroom could be anything. So I just decided to make it the uh, the actual service area of the church. This is obviously, you know, it's got a little gym set that's actually where the choir and stuff sing at our church. And then we have an well, altar, that's where the body of Christ would have been served. Um, we even look at that. So that right there is actually a handmade cross um so yeah that's a thing now and obviously you know all of the the lights and stuff i also added by hand which was not my favorite job in the world but you know we did we, we did things jeez he snores apparently but yeah then we have our little bar area here um and a little gaming area here that that is a gaming tv and stuff so yeah, this is, uh, this is, this is this. And Debbie is playing basketball right next to Trevor's head. But I assume because of the type of deal this is, she, he just, he's just fine with it, you know? Just, just fine with it. Oh, good, she's leaving. That's a, probably not a bad thing. I didn't know she was here. I will say, um, Trevor in the show is trans. So obviously in here he is, um... Also trans, he's actually played by one of my favorite actors, who is Elliot Fletcher, and um, we love him. So, and like everything else, he comes with, uh, you know, his little his thing here. He didn't really have a lot here. I'm sure he probably would be on a different section. I'm not sure what I wanted to do there. I did not give him a job. Um, it's not to say that he won't eventually have a job. It's just to say, you know, he doesn't have one yet. And then, of course, you know, he, he did come with skills and stuff. I actually kind of wasn't sure what his, like, what some of his skills would have been. So I just kind of put everything. Oh, I forgot to change up parenting. Oh, well. Um, but yeah, he's just kind of, he's got a little bit of everything. He's a little bit of a jack-of-all-trades sort of, sort of dude. Obviously, he's got, you know, I think I have only had set his relationship with Ian. But uh, apparently he's got a good, nice little friendship with, with both Debbie as well as Lip. And him apparently have amazing compatibility. So that's a wee bit interesting. Um, you know, he's on his period right now, so that's got to suck a lot. But it's it's fine. Uh, here is his traits. I have yet to look at the game-provided traits yet, so I'm kind of excited for that. So he is a sage sim. Sage sim, seek wisdom and focus on finding... The truth in every situation, however, their knowledge seeking nature might cause them to think too much and not act enough. Huh, interesting. Just, I don't think either of these really fit his character, but it's fine. I also forgot to take, I didn't put any milestones either. Um, he does, of course, you know, have likes, dislikes, all of that good stuff. Um, ignore the dislike of pink. That was just solely because, you know. I don't like the color pink. Who are you talking to now? Ian has an interesting look on today, but okay. Him and Ian are apparently talking. Should we go, like, be a little nosy? Where are they talking at? I, I bet they're talking in here. I just remember that I could do this quite literally. Where are they talking? <gasps> are they talking in here? What is he wearing? He's a kind of a cutie. I'm not going to lie. Like, this man be cute. He be a cutie. Y'all can fight me. Why are you not eating? Is it bad? Probably. I don't know. No, you, you eat your chicken, dude. You're hungry. You do your hungry thing. I did forget to turn this off, though. So we are going to have him step out of the, the limelight because he is not a famous person. That's just not our type. 
cup of tea today. So, no line lights for you. He obviously doesn't have, like, family pre-made or anything. I do want to just click on this and get him to go to a bathroom. I'm not sure which bathroom, but I would like to get him to go to a bathroom. Here is our everyday outfit. I love it. I think he's so cute, too. I think he's cute in real life, though, too, to be honest. To be fair, he is um a whole lot cuter than I could ever even want to be. And then, of course, we have his... Oh, I love this outfit. I don't remember. Is that... I think this is actually CC. Is The shirt is CC. Um, but, yeah. That's, it is what it is. And then... So... Good little workout outfit. Here's his sleepy time outfit. Ooh, I love the sleepy time outfit. I like these new pants. These pants are like my go-to. I love the texture on them. I I just, I, I do. I like them a whole lot. Here is our party outfit. Um, Slightly inspired by, I want to say they went to that diner that uh, Fiona was running with Ian? He went to the, the thing with Ian. I don't remember. It's been a while. Anyway, swimwear is pretty simple. I actually don't usually use these uh, shorts ever, so I was like, you know what? Nice time to, to try. And of course, cold weather wear, I believe, is also inspired by an actual outfit from the show. I don't know, though. And then this one I definitely know was inspired by an outfit from the show because that's when I started with these pants and I was like, God, I hate these pants, but they work. But yeah, no, I hate these pants. I, I want to change the pants. Should I change the pants? I might change the pants. Oh, but I can't. Okay, so I'm going to have to go into everything and actually, you know, save this without y'all watching everything. Do I want to change the pants? Hmm. Let's just see what we have because I don't like these pants. <laughs> I feel like these ones would be better. I think we're going to go with these ones just because I prefer those pants to the other ones with this outfit in particular. Every other outfit will keep the same. This one, I'm changing it though. I don't know. Yeah, this is definitely one that was inspired by an actual outfit on the show because sometimes he had the gauges and sometimes he didn't. And I very much preferred life with the gauges. So some of them don't have gauges and some of them do. Anyway, here we are. This is our a lovely nano. Oh, God, what was his name? <laughs> ah, his name is Trevor Fletcher. A lot of these houses and stuff will be filling in slowly. Sometimes, like this one, I almost gave up on. You guys should have seen the disaster that was the original version of this before I was like, you know what? I have a church. I actually know the inside of it. Why don't I just use that? Because that way I can actually kind of build it a little bit better. And I think it looks it definitely looks better than this one. So you know what? We're just going to call it a win, right? Anyway, so I did make a church. And, you know, I have some other sims and stuff that I will be planning on creating, making, all of that good stuff. You guys check out my about section of there, about the video section, whatever. Go look at the, the, the thingy down below the video. Anyway. Or don't. I Honestly, it's fine. Description. It's the description of the video. Again, if you don't want to, that's okay. However, that will tell you what we still have left to do in whatever world I am filming in at that time. So, like, you will know what's all going on here. Uh, a also little hinty hint of sh stuff is a lot of it I am building just kind of as I go. So... I know there was a video, hmm, when was it? Or it was just last week's video. Last week's video. I I don't even know if I had his name on here at all. Because I couldn't remember his name. Because I am a absolutely horrible person. But, because I had his name, I didn't have his name. I think I just had him as like man bro or whatever. So you might see a lot of those because that's what they that that's how I do my notes and stuff for myself. And I just am kind of moving notes to uh YouTube and doing it that way. But yeah, so Manbro here is kind of done. I have two households actually fully completed in Windenburg. 
Have a wonderful day, night, evening, morning, whatever it is, wherever you are, guys. Have a good one. Bye.